This is a scope video presenting the important steps of the surgical technique for arthroscopic treatment of chronic patella tendinosis. In this case, a patient is a 22 years old athlete, a soccer player suffering from jumper's knee. The left knee is affected. Under general or spinal anesthesia, the patient is positioned supine using a tie holder and an unsterile tunicate. After diagnostic rounds using a high anterolateral standard portal, an anteromedial accessory portal beneath the patellar next to the patellar tendon is created and pathologically inflamed soft tissue is resected and the careful partial resection of the hopper fat pad is done using a synovial resector and an electrocautery device preserving the main fibers of the patellar tendon. The bony tip of the patella is assessed by an examination hook after clear identification of the lower patella pole as well as the patella tendon. The bony tip, the non-articular patella surface of the patella is verificated and marked under atroscopic and fluoroscopic view by using a needle. The resection of the lower patella pole is performed step by step using a 4 mm burr. A final arthroscopic evaluation is performed after resection of the pathologic soft tissue as well as the removal of the bony lower patella pole. The extent of the resection is controlled arthroscopically and fluoroscopically to avoid a treatment failure due to an over or under resection of the lower patella pole or residual small bone peaks in the anterior part of the lower patella pole. At least a detailed joint lavage and wound closure is done. If required, an intra-articular drainage is placed.